Level 1, Stretch and Open. These breathing exercises and postures can be done while seated in a chair. Have a dora, a one meter length of cloth, ready to use for the postures. Sit with the feet about shoulder width apart, torso tall, and away from the back of the chair. Palms resting on the thighs. Begin with peaceful breaths. Shant pranayam. With the eyes closed, take three slow breaths. Try a six second inhale, seven second exhale. Visualize inhaling positive energy, and as you exhale, unburden yourself. Gradually with practice, you will increase the length of each breath. Jagya, awakening breath. Next, touch the fingertips lightly in front of the body. As you inhale, reach the arms out, stretching the fingers and continuing to reach up, touching the thumb tips together overhead. Exhale, sweeping the arms down, touching the fingers lightly again. Repeat Jagya breaths. Feel the muscles stretching. Calm the mind. At the next inhale, bring the thumb tips to the forehead in the mushkar position. Lift the chest, open the throat, lift the elbows. Exhale, lower the arms. Inhale, stretch the arms back, feeling open. Exhale, return the palms to the thighs. Take a calm breath. Wah Pranayam, breath of wonder. As you perform Wah Pranayam, feel a sense of awe and wonder at the universe. Sit towards the edge of the chair, feet pressed into the earth. Extend the arms down, shoulders down, fingers spread, chest lifted. Feel strong, confident. Extend the arms forward and up. Reach, arms are high, almost vertical. Gaze up, press the palms together. With feet separated and firmly planted in the earth, inhale, lowering the arms in front of the body, sweeping out to the sides. Raise the arms up. Touch the thumb tips if you can. Exhale, lower the arms out and down, completing the circle, bringing the palms together up high again. Repeat Vah Pranayam four more times. End in the mushkar breath. Bring the thumb tips to the forehead. Exhale, lower the arms. Inhale, reach back. Exhale, relax the hands on the thighs. Breathe calmly. Parvatasana with Adora. Parvat. Mountain peak pose, an asana of trust and self-confidence. Sitting tall, take your dora, your length of fabric, and hold each end in each hand. Extend the arms, open the fingers, bring the fingers down, then wrap the dora around the back of the hands, collecting it in your palms. Pull the dora outward, feel the strength in your shoulders, 
chest and upper back. Continue to keep the torso erect. Press the feet into the earth. Focus on the center of the dora. Close the eyes. Feel the intensity. Slowly raise the arms as high as you are able, up to a vertical position. Take care not to hunch the shoulders. Pull the dora with all your strength. Feel the muscles tremble. Hold for three breaths. Release. Inhale, extend the arms up as high as you can. Extend the fingers. Exhale, torso tall, lean to one side. Feel the stretch and the obliques, the sides of the body. Inhale, up. Exhale, lean to the other side. Inhale, up. Exhale, twist to one side. Arms extended up. Inhale forward, exhale twist, inhale forward, exhale lower the arms behind the head, broadening the chest. Lay the head back if this feels good. Take a breath. Inhale reach up. Exhale, relax, release. Roll the shoulders, releasing tension. Feel the pleasure of challenging yourself. Enjoy the release. Chariot one, prepare for chariot one. You'll use opposing forces to gain strength and balance. If you have any knee trouble and this pose does not feel good, do the chariot four instead, the next posture, with the dora. Always listen to your own body signals to decide what is best for you. You're seated away from the back of the chair. Hold the dora towards each edge. Extend the arms forward, chest lifted. Shift your left foot to center. Raise the right knee. Place the center of the dora onto the shin, just below the knee. Begin to lift the knee by pulling the arms up. Elbows lifted to shoulder height or as high as you can. Shoulders are not hunched. Chest is lifted. As you pull the thumbs towards the chest, press the knee out, building resistance. Take three breaths. Release. Roll the shoulders, relax. Prepare for the other side. Extend the dora forward. Shift the right foot in, raise the left knee. Place the dora onto the shin just below the knee. Lift the elbows. Press the knee out. Breathe. Relax, release, roll the shoulders, let go of tension, residue, anything you don't need to hold on to. Chariot four, sit tall, feet close, hold the dora at one end, extend the arm out, press the left foot into the earth, raise the right knee, place the dora under the knee, 
Hold each edge of the dora, knuckles facing up. Extend the elbows out. Raise the dora, lifting the leg. Elbows to shoulder height if you can. Let the weight of the leg go. Use your arm and shoulder strength to hold the leg up. Take three breaths. Release, relax. Do any releasing movement you like. Prepare for the other side. Extend the dora forward. Press the right foot down. Raise the left leg. Bring the dora under the knee. Raise the elbows. Let the weight of the leg go. Keep the chest lifted. Breathe. Release. Roll the shoulders. Relax in child's pose. Separate the feet a bit. Lean forward. Rest your chest onto the thighs. Let your arms drop. Relax the shoulders. Let the head get heavy. Take calm breaths in child's pose. Release tension from the spine, the neck, the shoulders. When you're ready, rise up and stretch. You're ready for the rest of the day. <laughs>